Welcome to another update video and this one is a special one because we're talking about a bunch of vinyls that I recently got from the Undercroft distro. Um, I didn't pay for any of them, he gave them all to me um, to promote so yeah it was a random mystery box which was fun kind of like you know those metal head boxes you get you don't know what you're gonna get until you get them so as soon as I opened it I was like holy shit this is cool so I'm gonna share it with you guys I'm gonna pop his link down below in the description so you can check out the store because there's a lot of cool content on that store including you know stuff like this vinyl cds everything you want cool black metal content it's all black metal and i'm going to show you what he gave me so let's dive into it with the first one which is funeral harvest so now the front part is actually a booklet which is actually really cool because each of the songs in the booklet has just cool art I'll try and show it to you guys. You can see cool art, the lyrics on each of the ones. Let's try and find another one. Just a cool band photos. I mean, look at this. It's neat. They didn't have to do this in the in the record, but they did, and it's just interesting to go through and check out. But the actual artwork of the actual album is right here, which is amazing. And this is an album I actually checked out. I think it was last year on black metal promotion just because of this artwork because I mean look at this fantastic it's like Lucifer or something all the angels just, I had to check it out with artwork like this and it's fucking amazing Funeral Harvest I can't remember the name of it oh it's down here Redemptio I'm pretty sure it's Italian black metal I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure it's Italian black metal band um, Furious Riffs Intense as Hell kind of melodic as well I'm um, really impressed with this album so I'm kind of glad he popped this one in because I didn't have it. So yeah, really good band to check out Funeral Harvest. One of my favorites from last year that I completely fucking forgot until he just gave it me. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. And I love the, the whole insert and the booklet and stuff like that. There's even a little poster in here as well, which I can get out. Let's, let's do it. Show and tell. Show and tell request it. Is it the right way? There we go. If you can see, because I can't see because my face is behind it. Yeah. A lot of cool packaging in here, a lot of cool stuff, so awesome, awesome stuff right there. Pleasantly surprised with that. The next one, show it right here. I can never tell the name of this, it's Of Of Norden, Of Norden. Now I never heard of this before, it's a recent one. I checked it out, checked out the album, um, actually it's an EP, sorry, checked out the EP, but it's quite long on YouTube and this is exactly my kind. Of black metal. This is exactly my kind. It's kind of folky, epic style of black metal. It's a similar kind of style as like, I don't know, like a Nocturnal Mortem, a um, Goat Moon, that kind of style, but mixing in a bit more punky edges as well. Uh, kind of like Black Magic SS, but I mean, look at the back art. You can tell if you're gonna like this stuff. You know, atmospheric, folky, pagan. Whoa, why's it gone black? Why's it gone black? There we go. Back to white. Yeah, love it. Lo love the art, love the music within. It's only an EP, but it's quite a long one. I think it includes a demo as well. From the Sword, the Sun Rose. From a name like that, you know you're gonna like it. Fantastic album. Next up are two from the same artist. Here's the first one. I forget the name of it. Ruach Ra, I've never known how to say that name. This is a recent project. This is the second album which is under the insignia of Baphomet. Again, I didn't hear this album until I saw it. I saw this one and I was like, oh shit, this looks sick. Gotta check this one out. And it's very war metal -y, very short songs, two minute, three minute long songs, furious, intense, in that kind of blasphemy, uh, arch goat kind of style. Furious, just intense the entire way through and I loved it. And the second one, which I did actually hear when it came out, was this one. I didn't realise it was the same band. But yeah, I don't know if people have seen this one. This one was actually from, I think, last year. So quite a recent release. I think I remember it on Bandcamp or on YouTube, something like that. But another fantastic release. So this is the latest one they did. The other one was from 2018. Um, not quite sure which one I prefer yet. I think they're 2018 one, but they're both fantastic. You might have seen that one recently on YouTube. Next up we have 1349, a more 
staple household name. You all know 1349, a classic band in the genre. And this is the Infernal Pathways, the latest album by the band. Fun stuff, not really mentioned this band at all on the channel, but we will rank them at some point. You want to rank all of them? You know, that's what we do. Really good stuff. You know, fans of like Dark Funeral and stuff like that. Um, it's a good album. Um, I don't know if it's my favourite by the band. We'll see. I'll need to go through every single one. But it's certainly a great album to have in the collection. And look, look at that art. you got to have some 1349. This is my first one, so there we go. And last but not least, we have the crazy shit. We have the insane album. <laughs> you, look at that art. You know when you're getting yourself in for with that. Just look at that mouth, like Slender Man looking fucker. Il John, and it is ridiculous. It's insanity. Uh, it's for fans of that kind of abrupt and like just. The vocals are just insane. Raw is all hell. Like one of the rawest albums. A lot of people, some people don't like it. I actually quite enjoy it, so I'm kind of glad I got it. And that art is just fantastic. So yeah, pure insanity, pure just fury on this album and it is sick and it's a clear double vinyl so pretty nice pretty nice there so overall didn't expect any of that you know didn't expect any of that so it was good um you know <laughs> to show it off to you guys and again thank you to undercroft distro for delivering this mystery box of goodies and again link will be in the description so you guys can check out the website for yourself and pick up some goodies like I have done. So yeah, let me know what you've picked up recently down below. Hopefully it's something good. <laughs> if, if it's something bad as well, let me know because that's even more fun. And yeah, we'll see you again on another collection update video. Goodbye.